This is the setup for a single beam reflection hologram. It's very simple. Light from the laser strikes this short focal length concave mirror. The light spreads and fills the area of the film plate. The object is placed just behind it, but not touching. In this case, the reference beam is that clean light that comes from the mirror and strikes the plate. The object beam is the light that reflects off the object. So some light strikes the plate, strikes the emulsion, which is back here. Some light passes through the emulsion, strikes the object, and then goes and hits the plate. So in this case, the fringes aren't spread across the emulsion. The fringes are stacked up in the emulsion. That means those fringes are very, very close together, and vibration is an even bigger problem with this kind of hologram than it is with the two-beam hologram. So to make the hologram, we have a shutter. We put a fresh film plate in here. We leave it because even though the film is very sticky, gelatinous, it does flow a little bit. So we leave it at uh, 10 minutes or so till it's settled down. And then we do the exposure by lifting, waiting for our vibrations to die out. Lift it, make the exposure, and that's it. We then develop the film, let it dry, and when it's completely dry, we're able to see the hologram.